Uh, I'm Dan Palmer. I'm here to run the Lyrics for Life competition. I just received a liver transplant a year ago. I've been a lifelong musician and this is a great opportunity for me to share with other recipients and allow them an opportunity to get on stage and express themselves through music. Uh, I didn't realize that I had liver disease and uh, eventually symptoms began to show and I began to swell rather rapidly with fluids. I gained 60 pounds from 185 pounds. I went to 245 pounds in a couple of months. I was told that by the first set of doctors that I would never be able to get a transplant, that I didn't have enough money. Uh, at one point they gave me a day to live. The next day they said, well, okay, maybe two days. By the time they released me from the hospital the first time, they gave me a prognosis of four months to live. They said, there's no hope for me, don't come back, there's nothing we can do, there's nothing you can do. Uh, but I waited for six years for a liver transplant. I was very sick and then got healthier and uh, had to move across the country because the organ donor shortage is so severe in California that you have to be very sick in order to get a transplant. So I took the initiative, uh, once I was healthy enough, to move all the way to Florida where the statistics were better. And I was able to get a transplant while well, I was still fairly healthy, so my recovery has been amazing. I've always been active hiking and snowshoeing and bicycling and uh, mostly low impact sports. All of a sudden I, wasn't, I didn't have the energy to do those. And post transplant, I wasn't even allowed to lift five pounds for six weeks. Fortunately my dog uh, was there and I had to take her for a walk every day three or four times a day. And I remember the second time I got out of the hospital, I had a walker and I, I could barely walk across the street. And it was a couple of months before I was finally able to take her just across the street. She has virtually walked me back to health. It's been quite the journey and I owe a lot to my dog and to my caregiver. I've had no contact yet with my donor family. I wrote a letter to them, but it was anonymous and I hope one day I get an opportunity to thank them because their gift has not just changed my life, it's the, changed the life of my family and my friends and so many others. And in response, I've dedicated, I had the chance a couple nights ago to share with a group of donor families and give them the vow that I'm going to continue to live my life it, differently than I did before, more purposefully, uh, and reaching out and living to honor the gift that they've given me, because it's a great gift. It's such mixed emotions, because for me to live, someone had to die, and there are people that are grieving for that person, even while I and my family are celebrating. Uh, it's, and that's what this games is all about. I'm Dan Palmer. I'm a liver recipient. I hope that you will live life and give life.